Peru's government is pushing ahead with a controversial gas project. It's going to be in an Amazon reserve for indigenous people. Rights Group now warned that the expansion puts isolated tribes in danger. Dan Collins explains. Tapping new sources of cheap fuel is central to President Ollanta Humala's pledge to locally source Peru's energy needs. Now, Argentinian-owned firm Plus Petrol has won the right to expand a part of Peru's abundant Camasea natural gas field called Block 88 further into an indigenous reserve. But anthropologists say the Kukapakori, Nawa and Nanti indigenous reserve is home to tribes living in voluntary isolation, as seen in these rare images. Experts argue the expansion is illegal under both Peruvian and international law. Energy policy is important, but it can't be at the expense of the life and health of the indigenous people. The constitution is clear on this. The state hasn't yet demonstrated that the activity it wishes to carry out is compatible with the continued existence of these indigenous people. Human contact for isolated tribes can be fatal, as they have no immunity to illnesses such as the common cold. But Peru's vice minister for intercultural affairs, Patricia Balbuena, says fieldwork found little evidence that the tribes were still living in most of the area. She tells CCTV that Peru will be more vigilant now than ever. If the company wants to enter the area, we must have a supervision plan and permanent monitoring. But critics say the government only reversed its view on the presence of isolated tribes in the reserve to push the project through. Several high-ranking officials resigned last year after their objections to new drilling in Block 88 were overridden. The prospect of boosting the domestic supply of low-cost fuel is clearly a tempting one for a government whose motto is inclusion for all. But Peru has committed to protecting the rights of all its citizens, even those who may not even know they're Peruvian. At the end of last year, James Anaya, the United Nations Special Rapporteur for Indigenous Peoples, recommended the state carry out a, quote, exhaustive study in the area. He said the expansion should not move forward before ensuring that indigenous rights would be guaranteed. Dan Collins, CCTV, Peru.